Haley Hollander, faculty member for PTA Global and co-founder of Advanced Training Performance. I think it's important to note the uniqueness of the Viper in the fitness industry and its ability to bridge the gap between traditional strength training and movement training. And I'm going to show you just how that is. I'm going to take a traditional exercise like the Romanian deadlift and use the Viper changing the series to show you how we can train for movement. A series on the Viper consists of different types of movements that the Viper does, including a tilt, a lift, a shift, a roll, a drag. I can also change my hold, my handprint, and my footprint that will change how the body responds to the movement itself. Here we go. Okay, so to start off, I'm gonna begin with that basic Romanian deadlift in the neutral grip on the Viper, neutral body position coming up and down into that Romanian deadlift. And then of course the first thing that I can do from here is I could change my hold on the Viper, having a longer lever length on one side, asymmetrically loading the body because how many times do we lift something that's maybe asymmetrical, causing our body to respond differently? Then I can take the Viper up and carry it as I come up and down into that Romanian deadlift once more, causing the weight the, the placement of the weight on the body to change how the body responds. I could take it up and over my back. And it's very quick, easy transitions, again, changing the hold. And then, of course, I can bring it over the shoulder, maybe more into a vertical type position with the Viper, change shoulders. And then from here, I could even change the lever length on the body, having more weight in front of the body or making it a little bit easier by bringing the lever back. And this would be similar to having maybe a backpack on your back and bending over and picking something up off of the ground. Then I could change the series into a tilt. So I have the Viper on end where I hinge from the hip, reach forward. This is getting a lot of mobility through the hips, the back of the legs. I can change the direction to which I tilt the Viper allowing the hips to turn and rotate, loading more into the lateral side of my body. Then I can go into single leg, targeting some balance and tilting the Viper. And I can change the series once more, where we go into a flip. A flip with the Viper is where it goes end over end. So maybe straddling the Viper, coming down, lift and flip. Lift and flip, lift and flip. And obviously the quicker you go with that, it's gonna make it a little bit more metabolic. So I can change the series again, and let's say we wanna go into a shift. So once more grabbing the Viper in a neutral grip, coming down into that Romanian deadlift, and shifting the weight of it from side to side, I again can change my hold and change how the body has to respond to the exercise and this might be similar to you know sweeping the floor or getting something underneath the couch when you're vacuuming you got that dust ball that's under there then I can go back to neutral I can add a rotation you can see how this allows my ankles to mobilize a little bit training more for movement then of course I can come up and rotate adding a little bit of a lift here in the series. And then I could even go into a drag. So straddling the Viper, coming down into that Romanian deadlift, push it out, push it in, standing up, and changing where you hold the Viper when you drag it each time. And if you wanna make this more metabolic, then of course, we can add a hop with every repetition and I can even change the series into a roll. So think of how many times you're down on the floor and maybe you're playing with a pet or a dog or a little kid and you're rolling something back and forth to them or playing a little game. So as you can see, changing the series with the Viper, how the Viper moves, allows us to train for movement, but because the Viper is a weight, we're still strength training. And again, the Viper and its ability to bridge the gap between traditional strength training and movement training is very apparent. And that's why this tool is so powerful. Thank you.